It's been a while, hasn't it? I almost didn't recognize you. Last time I saw you, we saved Rivenspire. The stakes are even higher now. And this time, Verandas isn't here. I need your help, my friend. We need to find out more about the Grey Host. You know the Raven Watch deals with threats all the time. Trouble is, there's never been a threat consisting of a reborn army of vampires and werewolves from the First Era. So yes, I could use some help. We need to know what they're planning. We know that one of the original ruling members of the Grey Host is rebuilding their army, gathering vampires and werewolves to their banner. And we know they're experimenting with life energy. So, what do you say? Ready for another adventure? Everything I learned up to now points in the same direction. Bankerai Garrison. There's a scholar named Noret Deal there who may be able to tell us more about the Grey Host and how they were defeated. Cart's over there when you're ready to go. Well, this isn't at all what I expected. What happened here? Oh, I'm sorry. Are you here for a tour? I'm afraid they've all been suspended until this mess with the Imperial Army is resolved. If I could offer a suggestion, turn around and head for the safety of Evermore's walls. As you can plainly see, now is not a good time. My fellow scholars and I fled when Septima Tharn and her Daedra-worshipping zealots attacked. We barely got out before the first impacts from their ballistae shook the walls. You did? Why didn't any of the knights report this? No one tells scholars anything. If that's true, and I see no reason you'd offer such an audacious lie, then thank you. Septima Tharn is mad. Had we stayed, she would have fed us to her Daedra. I'm sorry. Concern for my colleagues and the Pyrewatch warrior who accompanied them has my thoughts in a jumble. Uh, come to think of it, the Pyrewatch are experts on the Grey Host. Find my friends, and I'm sure the warrior will answer your questions. Their guardians sworn to watch over a Grey Host burial site located here in Bankarai. One of their warriors was here recruiting when the garrison came under attack. She went to protect my colleagues, but no one's returned. Can you go find them? Coglin and Indus fled in the direction of Evermore with the Pyrewatch warrior, while Jannard headed toward Kerbal's Hollow. Please be careful. The wilderness can be treacherous between here and there. Even if my mind wasn't clouded with worry, I'm an expert on the Second Era. My First Era knowledge is extremely limited. The Pyrewatch knows more about the Grey Host than anyone. Find her and my friends, and she'll provide the answers you seek. Thank you, friend. When you return with the scholar safely in tow, we should be able to put our collective heads together and dredge up that ancient history. That is, if the Pyrewatch warrior hasn't already satisfied your curiosity. Hmm. This scholar's research doesn't go back to the First Era. And the other scholars fled? That puts a wrinkle in our plans, all right. This Pyrewatch warrior is a promising lead, though. Let's go find her and the other scholars. I heard. Let's split up and go after them. All take Kerbal's Hollow. You head toward Evermore. Here, I'll mark it on your map. Yeah, my brother Fenorian told me about one he encountered. They're the guardians of an ancient mass grave where the remains of the Grey Host are said to be interred. Probably knows more than the scholars. Find them and meet me back here. Find the scholars, but try not to get eaten by anything. look like a refugee. Are you a soldier from the garrison? What news of the Imperial attack? 
Oh, that's wonderful news. Cogline and I intended to head straight for Evermore, but the cursed Imperials caught up with us. They would have captured us if not for that Pyre Watch warrior. Have you seen her? Is she alive? She was, but we ran into Imperials. The Pyre Watch warrior distracted the soldiers and ordered me to flee. Then she took Cogline and headed west. Please, find them. I worry for their safety. I will go to Scarlet Deal's camp now. We are most fortunate you came to our aid. Other than the fact that they were defeated here centuries ago, not much, I'm afraid. I can tell you Empress Hestra's legions came to the aid of Bankerai Garrison. That's why Hyrock became part of the Alessian Empire for a time. Alas, you seek facts and figures that I don't have readily at hand. Perhaps when I can retrieve my papers from inside the garrison? You know, the Pyre Watch Warrior might be able to help you. They're experts on the Grey Hosts of the First Era. I will return to Skaladiel's camp. May Tall Papa guide your steps. Um, I came to my job. Not with all this going on. The first thing I've seen that isn't an undead monstrosity. Oh, lovely. Uh, are you with the garrison? Please, tell me you're here to rescue me. Oh, thanks, Dandar. I thought I could make it to Evermore, but I tired myself out. When I tried to pass through the old graveyard, I ran into unspeakable horrors. Thought I was finished. I I'll head back now. Oh, say, did you find that Pyre Watch warrior? When the Imperials came after us, she managed to distract them and ordered me to run to the graveyard. I think she headed for the Crypt of the Exiles. Oh, I hope she found shelter within. We owe her our lives. Please, will you go check on her? I'll find Scholar Deal's camp straight away. I am in your debt. If I can do anything to aid you, all you have to do is ask. The army of monsters that ravaged the First Era? Not really my area of expertise. I study the historical accounts of Warlord Thorgreg's army of orcs and goblins. The garrison held strong and denied them passage. Not one got through. Truly inspiring. Well, most scholars agree that the fanciful legend about the Grey Host's defeat is, uh, pardon my orcish, guar dung. You know, the Pyre Watch are sort of Grey Host experts. Find her and I'm sure she can provide the answers you seek. I'll hurry back to Scholar Deal's camp. Be safe.
Come forward, you godless mongrel. My apologies, Wayfarer. The shadows make it difficult to discern friend from foe. You do not look like my enemy. Perhaps Tuwaka has not forsaken me after all. What are you doing in this wretched place? It gladdens my heart to hear that Scholar Deal is safe. But what of the other Scholars? Did my efforts to lead the Imperials away allow them to get away? That is truly fortunate. As for me, I escaped the Imperials only to find myself surrounded by ancient undead. Let us speak outside. I will follow your lead. May Onsi guide your blade. Lead on, Wayfarer. Exit. Let us see the sky once more. I came to Bankurai Garrison seeking recruits for the Pyre Watch. Hunding help us, I did not expect those villains to arrive and send innocent people fleeing for shelter. I am grateful you saved the scholars. Now what can I do for you in return? The Grey Host was a terrible army of vampires, werewolves, and other monsters that pillaged the land. Only the combined might of the Bankurai Garrison and the Alessian Empire finally defeated them. That story, unfortunately, is mired in legend. The true story may be as enthralling as the legends, but we only have bits and pieces of it. Magic was involved, almost certainly. But whether it was divine in nature or Alessian sorcery, we have never been able to determine. I can delve into the records of my order when I return to our sanctum. 
But understand that the Watch is concerned with keeping the past buried, not exposing it. I can tell you that there are indications that one of the hosts survived the slaughter. A Dereni noble. That gives some credence to the historical record. An incomplete parchment mentioned Viridian Watch, but we never saw the significance. It also said that only the worthy could enter the sanctuary. We never determined what that meant. I do not know the nature of your mission, Wayfarer. And I still have my own to uphold. But if you seek answers about the Grey Host, then may Mara bless your search. I know precious little. I never visited the site myself. Though incomplete, the historical record indicates the survivor hid in a concealed space that they were guided to. Perhaps that has something to do with the idea of being worthy. There wasn't much. Just that the worthy would be guided to safety. Perhaps that is the key, if you can determine what worthy means to a vile vampire. Any place associated with the Grey Host cannot be trusted. Evil does not fade. So be on your guard. I will go check on the scholars at Deal's camp. Thank you again, Wait. Good. You're back. I found Janard and I see you've managed to return with the rest. Show off. Now that we settled that matter, what did the Pyre Watch warrior tell you about the Grey Host? I was afraid of that. So much about the First Era has been lost. I wonder if the Pyre Watch knows anything about the other details we learned. About the survivor and their connection to a Dereni noble. That matches what we already uncovered, and confirms the Dereni connection. Did you find out anything else I should know? A riddle, damn it. There's always a riddle. Well, I say we go to Viridian Watch and figure this out on our own. I'll mark the location on your map. Now let's go before Scholar Deal tries to regale me with more tales of the Knights of St. Pelin. I'll meet you at Viridian Watch. There's a sigil, right there. Don't you see it? It makes so much sense. The riddle. Only those worthy can find the way to safety. Only vampires and werewolves can see these sigils. That explains why no one ever found anything. That's because you aren't a vampire or a werewolf. Hold on, I've got just the thing. Here, a blood pendant. It lets me share some of my vampiric essence so you can see the sigils too. It's perfectly safe. At least, Fenorian said it was harmless. 
We follow the sigils, of course. The Greyhost survivor must have used these as a guide, and they were made for that specific purpose. Now, let's see where they lead. Another one. Keep going west. South here. Not that we have a choice. East, down that tunnel. Let's go south, up those steps. Another one, northeast around this corner. Keep going straight. I think we're close. Ha! This must be it! Now how to go about opening it. That's done it. Let's check inside. Radha al Saran was a survivor, that figures, and Lady Thorne helped him. Or should I say, Lady Ingrid? Looks like he had quite the setup down here. I'm surprised that's lasted all this time. Wait, what's that? Let me see it. I recognize this signet, but that doesn't make any sense. I don't know. No, this can't be. But it is, isn't it? Damn it. I don't like where this is going. I've seen this signet before, or one just like it. My mentor, Count Verandas, had one. But why would he have something connected to the Grey Host? That doesn't make any sense. You're right, of course. There must be something we're missing. We need answers, and there's only one place to find them. Ravenwatch Castle in Rivenspire. Let's go. I'll explain more when we get there. I need time to think. Over here! Good, you made it. So, I've had some time to think. I know this may seem a little unorthodox, but I want to go into the castle through the secret passage. Yes, but we just learned that Count Verandas may have been involved with the Grey Host thousands of years ago and never told us. That disturbs me, and that never happens. I want to investigate this quietly before I involve the rest of the family. Other members of the house might be around. If they see us, they'll ask questions. I don't want to sully Verandas' memory with whatever this is. Not until we know for sure. I want to figure this out before we involve anyone else. I don't want it to matter, but it does. Why would you keep this from me? 
I need to see what's in the castle cellar. That's where he stored his private possessions. We followed his wishes and never disturbed the place. Until now. Come on, let's go. This way. The door's over here. Watch out for vermin. We don't fumigate down here as often as we should. Let's hurry to the cellar. I'm fairly certain I can get it unlocked. Give me a moment. Hurry now. Inside. See if you can find the signet. It must be in one of these crates or boxes. Another secret door? I didn't know that was here. It has the same mark as the signet. Maybe. Open. Let's see what's inside. What is this place? Did Verandas use this as a secret study? Check the desk, would you? That letter. What does it say? letter. Please tell me it's just an old to-do list or something, and not actually proof that the man I trusted with my life was involved with the Grey Host. What? Verandas, how could you? I don't want to believe it, and yet here it is, right before my very eyes. Why didn't he ever tell me? I thought I knew everything there was to know about him. No, there has to be more. What else does the letter say? It's possible that castle no longer exists, but I want to go. I refuse to believe Verandas was part of the Grey Host. There has to be more to this. Some piece of the puzzle that makes sense of everything. Are you still with me? Thank you. The cart's still waiting outside. We'll take it to the docks and travel by boat from there as we follow this map. Go on ahead. I want to take one more look around, make sure we didn't miss anything.
There's trouble in Crestshade, but I'm not sure I'll find a safe haven at that place up there. I think I'm as ready as I'll ever be. Delaying the inevitable won't help anyone, and it won't get me the answers I need. Come on, let's go see what's on this secret island. Answers, I hope. Look, I have to do this. I'm going to see this journey through, no matter what truth waits at the end. Let's just go. The sooner we get this over with, the better. First, however, take this. You earned it. That letter we found. I can't believe Verandas was part of something as evil as the Grey Host. I guess we need to go to the secret island, and the castle if it still exists. I won't rest until I learn the truth. The whole truth. Over on this, why didn't you tell us? <laughs> 